Hello everyone. Uh, in this in this video, I'm going to show you how to uh, add a print form control. Okay, so that okay, when the print button is clicked, okay, then okay, uh, you can uh, print only maybe okay, uh, this half of your interface. Okay, so uh, let me show you okay how to do that. Okay, so before you write code to uh, related to the uh, print button okay you have to uh, find the uh, visual basic power packs okay, uh, section first okay it is under the toolbox okay and then look for control okay called a print form okay and then select the control drag it drop one okay uh, there you go and then it will be put in the component tray. Okay, the reason is that okay, the print form uh, control is a non-printable. Okay, so even though I drop it onto the form, but uh, it won't show up over there. All right. Okay, so now I can add code to the print okay, uh, button. So select the button okay, and then double click it. Okay, and it put me into this code behind file. Okay, and then I can just write something like this, okay, me dot with, okay, and then, okay, me dot with, okay, me means the form, okay, the user interface, okay, the whole form, and assume I want to reduce uh, the width to about 125, okay, and then, okay, I can uh, use the uh, print form uh, control, okay, style, okay, to set it to uh, preview mode first. Okay, so okay, printing, okay, there you go, preview. And then, okay, uh, I can print, okay, I can print, okay, if I want to, okay. Just call the print method. And then, okay, once uh, the, uh, user, uh, the receipt have been print, okay, make sure you add the pixels, okay. Okay, I'm back. Okay, so now let me do this again. Me the width. Okay, and then add one to five. Okay, so now okay, let me run the application. And then if I click, I do a just do a, a quick test. Click the print. Ah, pretty good. So you see, okay, this will be the preview. Okay, of your uh, sales receipt. And it hide, okay, it hides the uh, buttons, okay, yeah, because end users uh, do not need to see those buttons, okay, they just need to see the date, the number of DVD uh, purchased, the number of Blu-rays uh, DVD purchased, and then the total disc, and then the total sales price. All right, okay, so if you want to print, you can click print, okay, and then uh, once you're done, you can click the close, okay, okay, let me cancel the print. Okay, then close it. Okay, then you can you will add okay, the 125 pixels back, and then uh, restore the form back to you. Then you can uh, uh, print out uh, different receipts okay, uh, based on different inputs. All right. Okay, that will be all. Okay, so let me stop it right now.